Oh, now we're getting there. <laughs> I was walking at the house with the like small plastic skis and I really wanted to ski. I was like, come on, get me on skis. I want to ski by myself. So uh, yeah, mom and dad said, okay, let's try. They dressed me up, put me in the ski boots, in the skis, and I skied. So <laughs> yeah, that, that was kind of it. Yeah, when I was a kid, I, I used to be a dancer, actually. <laughs> I still love to dance. Um, well, there's apparently not much time to do that anymore. But uh, yeah, I love uh, dancing. I like uh, mountain bike. I like uh, volleyball. It's uh, everything that has to do something with sports, actually. My first race, huh? like in a really nice, um, colorful <laughs> racing suit with uh, stars all over it. And I have some pictures and I still have my ski boots on quite a few hours later. It was not a problem to wake up early in the morning to go for training and then we like rush to school and then again for physical training in the afternoon and do all the homework. It came natural. So I just actually continue doing what I love. Sadly, the injuries are a big part of, uh, of our sport. I always try to learn something or to see the positive side of everything. At the end of the day, it can happen to anyone uh, at any time because it's the uh, nature of sport. So um, yeah, but now I'm really convinced that it's enough. After all, we still have to live a life after our career, right? So I guess at, um, at some point, um, when I will feel it, I will just know, okay, that's it, I've shown everything, but uh, no, I don't have that feeling yet. <laughs>